Well, I thought I'd give you a quick tour if you're new to cat trikes or recumbent trikes or shopping for a trike, any of the above. I thought I'd give you a tour of my 559 that I bought back in March and bought my wife a cat trike to Mont. But some people wonder what kind of accessories you can get on here and what the bike looks like. Um, in here, this is just obviously an overview of the cat trike. Got a lot of bags and stuff on it because we carry extra batteries in that. But let's start up here in front. Right here in front, we took off the reflector because we don't really ride at night, not worried about people seeing us. So we took the reflector off and we put the GoPro right here, mounted it, which works great. I can say like GoPro record, GoPro stop, and it can hear me so I don't have to reach up and get it. We also added, um, we had SPD pedals forever, and I've always wanted to try egg beaters, and they obviously look like egg beaters, hence the name. Um, I think they are great, easy to get in, easy to get out of, while still holding your foot in there secure, no leg suck. Got a little bag here that we used to carry our uh, pepper spray in for the dogs that might find you to be a play toy for them but I'll show you what we've done made some changes with that and we added this adjust the matic uh, it's kind of hard to see right in here it holds two bottles you can tilt it away from your body or towards your body whatever your preference is and over on the other side on the left hand side controls we also have the computer for it we added this uh, phone holder which works great doesn't interfere with pedaling or anything. We also have the standard mirror that came with this, which six foot four, 260, sometimes it doesn't see around my shoulders or maybe my middle. <laughs> so we uh, got a little bit longer uh, mirror that works great. Doesn't jiggle at all. So we put that on that side. And then underneath this, if I come around to here, we also have our alarm mounted underneath here. So we have a remote that you just click it and if Sony moves the bike, it has an ear shattering, piercing siren. We also don't ride at night, but we do have these lights mounted down here on the bottom of the frame. And uh, they have all the different four functions that you would normally expect to find on lights. Got the regular seat. Like I said, I'm six foot four, 260 pounds depending on how much pasta I've had to eat this week. Um, let's look at this other side. On the other side, we bought another accessory mount arm from T-Cycle, which is where we get all of our accessory mounts. We have a Skydio drone, and they have a beacon that the drone will follow you. You don't have to do anything, it just tracks. So we have a beacon mount right there. Uh, see, this is where the battery goes back here. Battery's not on there right now. We had a rack put on both of our bikes. We had these bags on our Specialized Como e-bikes. We love our Kelb Quality, Canadian company. These two, the bag you see, the pannier on the side, actually will turn into a backpack. Never use it as a backpack, but you have that ability. Carry a lot of stuff in there, but that's another video. We also have a smaller Arkel bag right here that used to hang on the back of our road bikes but it fit on this as well. And then we also have bag on this side. We do, like I said, we have uh, extra batteries for our bikes. So we don't have to worry about, are we gonna run out of battery? We could probably do 150 miles and not be short of batteries. Had this flag that we bought at Hostel Shop. Uh, it doesn't create any drag. I'm not in the Olympics. So I'm not trying to shave seconds off my time. No, it's not noisy, you don't hear it. It's behind you and when I fo follow my wife, I hear hers flap a little bit, but it's not that big a deal. We have fenders on everything, even though most of the trails we ride are rails of trails that are paved. We're gonna do some gravel riding later on this year. Um, but um, we just got the stock tires and everything that came with this. Like I said, this is, maybe I skipped over this a little bit, this is an ECAT. Powered by Bosch, fantastic. Uh, their display to interact with it is great. 
the motor is great we had a Bosch motor on our specialized Camos and uh, just all around good bike I said here's another shot of the adjustomatic um, adjustomatic uh, water bottle holder carries two bottles we now carry our pepper spray in one and water bottle in the other because we have extra water, bo water bottles that we carry in our backpacks here. So that's just a quick overview of my Catrac 559 in electric blue. Blue is my favorite color. They happen to have one in stock. Bought this one at Wheel and Sprocket because that's what they had available in March. Bought my wife's um, Dumont up at the hostel shop. Both great places. Oh, and one more thing, as Steve Jobs would say at the end of his Apple presentation, we also have the hydration pack for longer rides. Usually, for just going out for a 10, 15 mile ride, we'll have a bottle, a couple of bottles of water. But this hydration pack mounts right underneath along the side of the seat. Put your hydration pack in there, your bladder comes right out the top, and uh, easy access for those longer rides. Lots of ice in there, let the ice melt as you go. Uh, but miss that part on the original video. So just wanted to add that in here.